Nel Salone Internazionale di Ginevra siamo con il signor Marcel Gross che è Sales Manager di Roof Automobili. Good morning, I present you to the Italian public as Sales Manager of Roof Automobili. And I would like to know about uh, the very nice electric cars that uh, your company do. Yeah, our first uh, prototype was built in 2008. The motivation was that in our family, in, in our family business, um, we also have hydroelectric power plants. And so the motivation was to bring this clean electricity, this energy into our sports cars. And so the first prototype was built. And then um, we um, developed it further and further and presented 2009 here at the Geneva Car Show the first e-roof uh, roadster. And today, two years later, we're very proud to show the real drivable car because two years ago it just was a prototype. And this car is already, has already been built uh, 10 times and is used for a long time endurance test now that we do in uh, cooperation with the German government. And we will drive this car, uh, these cars will be driven for about half a year in order for us to collect the data and to get experiences in order to finalize the development and be able to really offer a car for sale by the end of the year. There are some special type of collaboration with the Porsche Germany, uh, considering that uh, you are uh, developing the electric cars that is very important for all automakers in this moment. Yeah. Well, um, Especially for us, we don't have um, a cooperation with any car manufacturer, but we have a cooperation together with Siemens. Siemens is supplying the electric motors and the inverters for this car. And then we have a German a battery um, manufacturer, Litec, that is supplying us with the cells for the batteries. But this um, development is completely um, um, ex uh, executed by ourselves and managed by us. Uh, do you can tell more about the technical uh, data of this car? Yes, um, we have um, three different types of, um, of um, setup. One, one uh, type is a central motor that goes directly on the rear axle. This car that we have here has two electric motors that also go together to the rear axle. And the third version is um, also a two-motor concept, but it uses torque vectoring, so you don't have any differential or any mechanical connection between the wheels. Um, we have about uh, 29 kilowatt hours of capacity and together with the recuperation that we use in this car we can uh, have a, um, a range of about 200 kilometers that you can drive with this car. You recharge it right here with this um, wire directly at home or wherever you want to recharge it and the top speed is 250 kilometers per hour and with about uh, 700 newton meters of torque, you have a very strong acceleration right from the start, as we know it from all the electric cars. Which type of batteries do you use? It's lithium-ion batteries, but as we said, it's only the cells that we buy and the rest we develop on our own, the complete management system and cooling system. And these same cars that are in circulation in Germany, they are all homologated for normal circulation and as, as a way that everyone that can uh, buy this car can use or is a special homologation for this uh, program of test? Yes, um, right now it's a, it's a special homologation because um, the car, the setup of the car is not finalized and not decided and therefore we cannot go to the homologation office and get it homologated for this specific setup because then when we change something it will not be valid anymore. This is the reason why they're homologated as test cars but they, are, they have more or less the same safety requirements as a regular car. So in times of um, overheating or, or stability or anything else, we are in the same region as a, as a regular um, mass production car. And the company has some idea about uh, if and when can be on sale this car? Yeah. Well, um, following our time schedule, we should, uh, in fall 2012, fall this year, we should have um, the version that can be sold to a regular customer, homologated and completely finished. And about price? The price starts at about 200,000 euros. Um, this has, is mostly um, uh, connected with the price for the batteries, of course.